What's going on guys? Geosnowder here. So in today's video, I'm going to show you how to jailbreak iOS 10.2, 10.1.1 or 10.0.x without using any computer. And this time you're not even going to touch CDI Impactor. In fact, you don't even need to be jailbroken for it to work. I mean, you don't have to use extender or something like that, which requires a jailbreak. As you can see, I do not have Yalu, and the reason I don't have it is because it expired after seven days, so I decided to remove it completely. And there is a website created by this guy in here, uh, Yasin uh, A Y ouch, I can't really pronounce that thing. But anyways, he's a good beginner developer and he made this website in here. I discussed with him, he assured me of the fact that this is legit and it's not creating any problems and it really installs Yalu. In fact, I have checked that. And um, the website is ayouch.me, but the uh, the full address is this um, ayouch.me slash gbme.html. This is the uh, website you need to go here. You have this YALU 102 updated, um, which means he updated the certificate, I think. And then you have the install button. You click install, you simply go ahead in here. You can see that I'm not jailbroken. In fact, I'm going to show you before installing. You can see Cydia doesn't start, Miriam doesn't start. I'm not jailbroken. And uh, let me try another tweak. For example, terminal, it doesn't start. And uh, therefore I'm not jailbroken. And I'm going to install this without even being jailbroken and without even touching the computer. It installs the jailbreak, click install, get out of here. You can now close Safari if you want. And as you can see, Yalu starts to install itself. It says waiting, then it goes around here. Now you should keep in mind as uh, the developer has also stated on his Twitter, the certificate can be revoked by Apple should uh, they detect this and so on. So use it while you still can. Uh, you can see it says installing, there you go, it installed finally, but you need to confirm the developer account. So you can see it says untrusted. To fix that you go to settings, wait for a couple years to load, go to general and then scroll until you find the profiles and device management. You go ahead in here and you are going to have enterprise app and you go to your Shanghai uh, demo or digital whatever. You click trust in here, trust again, there you go, I'm going to close anything in here and I'm going to try to open Yalu now. Fair enough, and it goes like this. Let me try to jailbreak with it to test whether it works or not. Okay, fair enough, it apparently uh, managed to jailbreak my device. You do not need to change uh, anything, your jailbreak will still work if you were jailbroken with the uh, IPA version. This one will still jailbreak with no problem, you're not going to lose your Twix. As you can see, all my Twix and my things are installed. I can open my um, jailbreak related applications, for example, Miriam, the application that I made. Uh, let me try to open Cydia. You can see Cydia pops up perfectly, so the jailbreak does work. The code is actually the original code from Lucardesco. You just uh, change the way it um, installs the application. You install it from a website instead of sideloading it. So um, as you can see, Cydia works. Let's have a try with the terminal. Okay, you name dash a. Yep, you name dash a. Fair enough. Okay, works perfectly. So this is the uh, official Yalu. I'm going to talk with him. Maybe he can uh, he can add Yalu Dark for those of you who are using it. But for the moment, you can install the official Yalu and jailbreak your device if you're. I don't know, on a road trip or you're not home, you don't have a computer with you, you're not jailbroken anymore, your device rebooted and I don't know, it ran out of power, rebooted and now you need to jailbreak and you don't have the Yalu app anymore. So yeah, fair enough, you can do it. Um, I'm pretty glad this exists. Go ahead and use it, it's in the description down below. Subscribe to stay updated, check out um, the developer's Twitter in the description down below as well. Tell me in the comment section down below if you have iOS 